Okay, this will be, it's a bit boring uh, color wise, but I'm pretty sure we can probably do something with it. Let's see if we can make this turn up a treat. So yeah, it's a boring piece. <sighs> Gonna reduce it, it's large. Gonna add a bit of extra contrast. See, we're going to go here, take out some background. Let's see if we can make this look any good. Let's see what it is. It is the House of Wellness. And this is supposed to be Delta Goodrum. I don't follow her. She's not my cup of tea. I don't like her music. It's so boring. It just doesn't appeal to me. Um, She's just another celebrity, and there's another Delta Goodrum on the back with her perfume called Destiny. Whatever, I don't care about this shit. Don't care about it. Delta Goodrum isn't my isn't my type of music. But she's become mainly a celebrity. You don't. I haven't listened to the radio for a while, but I haven't heard her on the radio. But she used to be producing music, and that's how she became famous, I think. But she's just a celebrity that people seem to like following. She seems to be mainly a celebrity for the sake of celebrity, if you know what I mean by that, folks. Uh, that looks interesting, but it's, it's not what I want. But basically, yeah, she's just one of those types of celebrities that you just, they, she just, she's just one of those celebrities that, that diehard fans follow, or maybe just celebrity watchers uh, following her, seeing what she gets up to and shit. I don't know. I don't fucking do all this shit, this boring celebrity worship crap. I've got better things to do with my time than fuck around like that. Um, I'm just not into it. I do think I'm too smart to be a celebrity watcher. I am. I'm too smart for it, folks. <laughs> I just don't. I just don't have the the boring attitude that a lot of people have uh, towards celebrities. I just don't. I just can't be a part of this boring uh, follower scene that we have. Because everyone just seems to follow, you know? I follow people on Twitter and that because I've got certain important reasons. I do it for a good reason. I don't just do it just for the sake of it. I can't disclose why I do it. It's, it's basically a part of my, my future. It's to set me up. Uh, for my own future and now that looks interesting um, but again it doesn't look like it's mirror image friendly um, but basically yeah I just I don't just I don't follow people like I follow like people follow celebrities I have another reason to do it I do it differently for a different reason uh, it's a highly competitive world out there on social media and I have to basically prepare myself for a future so we're going to photocopy this image of Delta so yeah I just don't have time to uh, to just follow people just for the sake of following just to keep up to you know just so I can brown nose someone because I'm not into brown nosing folks or, or kissing ass or sucking on ass or licking ass as it's a bit, try to be a little bit rude and crude regarding that people 
have a habit of um, kissing each other's ass in this world, that people just uh, can't be themselves and they have to fucking be in the in crowd and all that and trying to suck up ass to the in crowd when really you don't you know you gotta you gotta do everything in a targeted fashion so let's see how delta looks now let's see how we go that looks interesting looks better but I don't like that black triangle bit uh, there's always something I don't like about sometimes my images um, but basically yeah I just I just don't have time to um, to kiss kiss ass I just I, I, I know that the world and social media is highly competitive you know Twitter is a very aggressive place to be you get the feeling that people are just really can be really shallow and difficult on twitter uh but i still need to use twitter folks i have my own agenda a very important agenda but it's not an agenda i can actually reveal it's a it's something on now that looks really cool Delta Goodrum looks like she's been improved and I've got a nice piece for a demo to finish to make my demo but basically people just are just blind followers of celebrities and basically that's not something that I'm interested in uh, I basically don't have any interest in just being just following just because I admire someone you know I do sometimes admire certain people but I don't admire them to the point of kissing ass uh, and some of these videos that I make uh, do end up on Twitter so yeah but they have to be um, they have to be like no more than seven minutes. Seven just on the videos I put on Twitter have to be less than seven minutes in oh less than eight minutes in length uh, from how I shoot them here. So they have to be time lapsed and then they're uploaded to Twitter. And I have a place in Twitter. Twitter has a place in my world, but I'm using it in a certain fashion that I can't disclose but basically yeah you'll find out eventually what's going to happen once things once things go crazy um, with the social media uh, I do I do most video sharing platforms I don't do uh, TikTok or or uh, Snapchat, but I do most of the other video sharing social media sites. Even if sometimes some videos don't fit, uh, like Twitter, or as I said, Twitter is like two minutes and 20 seconds maximum in length. So I have to, as I said, I have to time lapse my videos on a video editor before I can upload them to Twitter. So yeah. Well, let's see how this goes. This video is not going to end up on Twitter. It's way too long. Because there's only so much you can do with the time lapsing. If you make it too if you make your source videos too long, your time lapse is going to be too fast and you won't see what I'm doing properly with my video work. So you have to basically choose videos that are not terribly long. I have to yeah but this one will end up probably on Facebook as well as YouTube uh, yeah anyway that Delta Goodrum looks really quite interesting I think now we can call this demo quits